I've been using this program called Labyrinth and it's a mind mapping program. I like this better than FreeMind mainly because it's um, you know, it's a native GTK app and they do have some better features like adding images and you have more control of what you can do uh, as far as connecting uh, your your thoughts. So let me show you here. So Labyrinth all right. Now the interface right here, it, it looks kind of like uh, Tomboy or Gnote, and I like that. It's really simplified, you know. So let me click on a new here, and you have like a new canvas here. But let me zoom in here and then make a new one. So the first mode you have is your edit mode. So you click on here, and let's say you put Ubuntu or something. All right, that's your main idea. And if you want to connect this to maybe like a new one, I don't know, put Linux. And there you go. Now, if you want to do this to different one, um, I, I don't know, Debs or something, right? Now, you want to connect this one to a new one. Uh, you have to click on this first, and it'll turn blue, and then boop, you click here, and maybe put packages or something, and it's connected. Now, you want to use like connect both of them to a single idea. Uh, you can go highlight that too and then click on here and you put like uh, I don't know um, RPMs or something All right, and then connect the dots over there uh, if you don't like that thing you can just highlight it and then hit the delete key and then you delete it All right. another thing you can do is uh, add images so if I click on maybe this and then I add an image or a dot to it I hit that thing and I hit on a empty space here and let's find some uh, pictures something small what is this 7k okay there you go that's something small all right and you can uh, you know rescale it whatever you want resize it uh, so that's what you can do and there was this other one you can do uh, make a pretty drawing um, let's see if we can do that um, here and then you can draw some stuff I don't know Whoop. Whoop, there you go. So that's basically it. You can actually change, um, you know, the the was it the color of the fonts, uh, the size of the font. Not not a big deal, but really basic. I dig it. Uh, and when you export, you can export as image, or just export the map uh, file. So let me show you that. So if I go, what is this? So this is our image, and if I export this as an image, uh, it's a PNG, and we put it in the desktop. You can see. Okay, so it's created here. What is this? And there you go. We have our image that we created, right? Uh, really cool. Dig that. And the other one is just uh, you know, it's coming out as a uh, dot maps with a Z at the end. If you want to. Uh, send it to your friend that has the same program to use so that's pretty much it I'm really digging this one uh, you have more control and you have images so I dig it right like this better over in free mind that's it